So an interesting probabilistic problem is how do we optimize the chance of marrying the perfect spouse? So let's imagine an extremely simple game. All you have is a box containing a lot of pieces of paper, and on each piece of paper is written a different number. It could be a positive number, it could be a negative number, it doesn't matter, but all the numbers have to be different. That's all, okay? Now, let's imagine that the box contains a large number of pieces of paper, and the rules of the game are very simple. You reach into the box and you pull out a piece of paper and you read the number on the piece of paper. Your objective is to guess which is the biggest number in the box. That's it. And if you do, you win the game. And if you don't, you lose the game. What do you think your chances are of winning this game? So suppose, for example, there are 100 pieces of paper in the box. Would you guess that your chance of winning this game is, say, 5%? 10%? Do you think you could win this game one out of 10 times if there were 100 pieces of paper in the box? What if there were a million pieces of paper in the box? What do you think your chances are of winning this game? The answer is that it's better than one out of three, no matter how many pieces of paper there are in the box. And this is an amazing probabilistic result it's extraordinarily hard to believe. The exact chance of winning the game is one over E. E is a fundamental number in mathematics. E is about 2.7. In fact, E is 2.71828 and so on. So one over E is bigger than one third. So your chances, the probability that you'll actually win this game are better than one in three. Okay, so how do you play the game? What's the right procedure? So what you do is you have a whole bunch of pieces of paper to look at. Let's imagine, we'll, we'll indicate all these pieces of paper by a bunch of strokes here, okay? And you look at this paper, and you look at this paper, and you look at this paper, and so on. <clears throat> What is your strategy for winning? Well, the strategy is to look at a certain percentage of pieces of paper and to decide beforehand that you're going to say, no, this is not the biggest number, no, this is not the biggest number, no, 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 no. So what you're doing is you're taking a sample, okay? So for the first number of pieces of paper, you have decided that the biggest number is not going to be written on any of these pieces of paper. And then the strategy is to take, if, if you haven't lost the game by then, the strategy is to take the next, keep looking at pieces of paper, and to take the next bigger number that comes along, and to say, that is my choice for the biggest number. Okay, and now you may either win or you may lose, but this strategy is so powerful that your chances of winning the game are really impressively uh, large. Even for a billion pieces of paper in that box, your chance of winning that game is better than one in three. And this is hard to believe, but this is in fact the strategy that you should use in finding a spouse.